Welcome back to the channel. Today we are diving into a detailed comparison of two popular Linux distributions, Fedora Linux and Manjaro Linux. Whether you are a developer, gamer or someone looking to switch to Linux, this video will help you understand the key differences, strengths and ideal use cases for each distro. Let's first talk about the overview and philosophy. Fedora and Manjaro are both well regarded in the Linux community, yet they cater to different audiences. Fedora is developed and backed by Red Hat and is known for its emphasis on stability, security and integration with enterprise grade technology. It is considered a cutting edge distro that also serves as a testing ground for future Red Hat Enterprise Linux innovations. Manjaro, on the other hand, is based on Arch Linux, but is designed with user-friendliness in mind. It offers the benefits of Arch rolling release model, meaning you always have access to the latest software while providing a more accessible installation and configuration process. Manjaro targets power users, gamers, and enthusiasts who crave customization without the steep learning curve of a pure R system. Now let's talk about the package management and software updates. Let's talk about the package management. Fedora uses the RPM package format with DNF as its package manager. The system is highly robust, providing excellent dependencies management and security updates that are thoroughly tested before release. Fedora follows a point release model, meaning you get a fresh, stable version approximately every 6 months. Each version is maintained with security and bug fixes for a set period. Manjaro, built on Arch Linux, uses Pacman, a package manager known for its speed and simplicity. Thanks to its rolling release model, Manjaro continuously receives software updates allowing you to enjoy the latest kernels, drivers, and applications. Additionally, Manjara gives you to access to the Arch user repository, which is AUR, which offers thousands of extra packages 